welcome to another video i am aima and if you just see me for the first time you want to quickly hit on the subscribe button because i don't think you want to miss out on my next upload i was supposed to start filming from sunday because technically i wanted to film a week in the life of a self-employed youth but i just kept on forgetting to hit the record button and i want this you know i want to capture every important moment of this week However, in case you didn't know, I am a freelance makeup artist based in Benin and I just wanted to document this week of creating content for Facebook by Emma because I haven't done that in a while. Most times I'll be filming on my personal page, right? And I don't want to neglect where I actually make money from. So this um, vlog, you guys are going to see how I get models, how I, you know, create content from home basically and but right now i want to take out this braids because it's scattered and we don't do scattered over here it no longer fits my aesthetic if you know what i'm talking about so yeah i hope you enjoyed this vlog and i hope to see you in the end of the video hi guys what is up okay where are we now i've taken out my braids i have washed my hair and i've also weaved it obviously um i mentioned something yesterday like a week in the life of a self-employed youth but if i want to dive into a week in the life of a self-employed youth like myself that would be a repetition of what's happening today of what's going to happen today and i don't think i i don't think it makes sense to have the same routine in the same video so we're going to like just cut that short okay so what is up right now is first things first we needed a model and i found a model luckily for me she's not a professional model though but i just need a face okay and i need a face to practice and she's available for that um the second thing i'm going to do is set up she's going to be here like in an hour set up and this is basically where i set up this is my chair i'm going to put the um backdrop here i'm going to show you guys what i use as my backdrop and the color of backdrop for this particular uh, model that i'm going to work with today and you guys should just you know stick with me and don't forget to subscribe if you're watching this and you have not subscribed it feels like you're stealing from me at this point okay so please subscribe to my channel i feel like this vlog is going to be really insightful so you want to like stick to the end i'm also going to create content like this occasionally because i mean this is like behind the scene of a more of a beauty enthusiast of a self-employed of a content creator so definitely see more content like this in the videos that are yet to come okay so yeah background i'm going to use this is a cotton i didn't get the i didn't have the, um, any need to buy a backdrop because i already had a plain background i like to use black because when i use black it actually helps in the photography all attention and focus would be on what i am showing you and this goes well because in case whatever the model is going to put on it's not going to contrast yeah it's not going to contrast so i think i'm just going to like hang this at the background here and during the photography section you guys are going to see the effect of using a black background as to regards to any other white is still good white is still good but i would rather use black in this particular shoot yeah. not me coming on here like i wasn't on onto something on the last clip but i failed yes it didn't go as i wanted it and i didn't even film clips of it so this is something else to note there are times when you try and you fail like the whole thing wasn't just given and i couldn't like post it or talk much about it I did my best though it was okay but it wasn't good enough to market the brand i did ask a couple of my friends just like three people that i really care about their opinions and their response was not exactly bad but i could tell their countenance wasn't the same as it would have been if it was a great and flawless job do you understand so you just i just have to use my sense yet so yeah um i'm currently in the west yeah i left the south that's been in currently in the west and currently in Lorraine. yes just to take like a break but that doesn't mean i'm going to stop creating videos you know so today i intend on visiting the like best 
um I'm an adjoint in Illinois. I mean this is Yoruba land, so there's no way that I'm 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 should be bad, right? So I've had Amala before Shabo. I think it was one of my best experience. I want to have the full experience and I'm obviously going to share it. So I'm just gonna be done with my morning routine and all of that then i'll come back to check on you guys when i'm about to go and eat Later that same evening. Say she had bad. Anytime I knock, I knock with that. No rubber band, no rubber band. Every time I put down, you show me that. If I know, pull out, she got my back. I do you go, I'm happy that. I do you go. Say everything I do is for my woman. Anything I do, where you So, guys, I'm about to leave the house. I don't know how bright this video is, but I'm trying my best. I'm literally standing in front of lights. So yeah, I'm about to leave the house. Let me show you guys what I'm putting on. So this is what we are wearing. I took a scarf just in case I become uncomfortable later, Sha. Because I'm not used to showing so much skin when I'm not in the pool. place we went to they didn't sell amala they sold other types of swallow share but the goal is to eat amala and if we're not seeing amala there we're not going to eat there so yeah we're going to try another place now and i'll show you guys when we get there Bakery's real. No, oil. No beans. Ground, grounded beans, yeah. Like the orange thing. Yes. It's very nice. It's very sweet. So what's your remark? Hi guys, so I'm back from eating amala <laughs> um i think i think i showed the location in the last clip but the reason why the last clip was cut short because i was running out of space but i've been able to like delete some things off my phone anyways 
I'm sure glad that I had the chance. I can finally say yes, I've eaten amala and I, I like it. I can relate when people are talking about it and all of that. It was really nice, it was tasty. You know, do I think it's goated? I think it's good. It's good enough. Do you understand? Like, I just like it. It's a different type of food from a different um, tribe. So everything makes sense. And yeah, so I think this will be the end of the vlog. I hope you guys will enjoy this because I swear, when I started filming this, I didn't expect it to end like this. And I think I've been able to take you all along with me in a realistic week in my life eventually. So at the end of the day, it was a week in my life I actually filmed. So yeah. So I'm going to talk to you guys some other time. Bye.